Last year, astronomers were puzzled when Betelgeuse dramatically faded, but then recovered. The dimming lasted for weeks. Hubble found that the dimming corresponded to a gaseous outflow that formed dust, which briefly obstructed some of Betelgeuse's light from our view, creating the dimming effect. Now astronomers have discovered that the red hypergiant, V.Y. Canis Majoris, which is far larger, more massive, and more violent than Betelgeuse, experienced much longer, dimmer periods that last for years. New findings from Hubble suggest the same processes that occurred on Betelgeuse are happening in this hypergiant, but on a much grander scale. Here we see some of the structures close to the star that are relatively compact knots. By using Hubble to determine the velocities and motions of the close-in knots of hot gas, astronomers were able to date these eruptions much more accurately. They found that many of these knots link to multiple dimming periods in the 19th and 20th centuries when Canis Majoris faded to one-sixth its usual brightness.